Well, this week is the beginning of Hanukkah. It uh, started Thursday night, the 10th, uh, whenever you see this, this video. Uh, but it's a very unique holiday. It has an interesting connection with those of us who are followers of Jesus. Uh, the connection is, is that it's a solidly, strongly Jewish holiday that only appears in Holy Scripture in the New Testament. Uh, because it happened after the Old Testament was closed, uh, the canon was closed. Uh, and so it happened a century and a half before uh, Jesus. And it was, it appears, the story of it appears in the uh, books between there, the historical, historical books uh, called the Maccabees. And uh, it's just, it shows up in John chapter 10 and verse 22. It says, then came Hanukkah. It was winter in Jerusalem and Jesus was walking in the temple around Solomon's colonnade. Well, if that sounds familiar, it's because in the book of Acts, that's where all the Jewish believers, the new church, that's where they were meeting. Uh, so they just, they hung out there for years, uh, maybe until the temple was destroyed. Uh, but Hanukkah is, is the holiday that celebrates God's provision for his people. And so what Jesus spoke about on Hanukkah in John chapter 10, he describes there his bond with his people. He describes his bond with us. And right now in this middle of this pandemic, some of us could use a reassurance and reminder that God is truly bonded to us and we're bonded to one another. And so he speaks about his deep relational he speaks about our relationship in a deep, organic way. I mean, it's not just a, a, a legal treatise. It's not a machine. It's, it's as natural as can be as, as, as our relationship with, are with other people. So uh, he said this, My sheep, that's us, my sheep hear my voice. I know them. And they follow me. I give them eternal life. They will never perish. And no one will snatch them out of my hand. That's pretty cool. That's marvelous. My father who has given them to me. So we're related with him and Jesus. My father has given. Uh, he says my father has given you guys to me. And uh, he is greater than all. And no one is able to snatch them out of the Father's hand. And then he rounds a circle and says, I and the Father are one. Uh, so we are connected uh, to God as his people. He's related to us and he wants us to remember that and know that. So if you uh, light a uh, uh, a candle on your Hanukkah this year, uh, each day for, for uh, Hanukkah, when you do it, remember that this is the opportunity Jesus took to describe his relationship with us, how much he loves us and how close he is to us and that we are connected to him because we know his voice and we hear his voice and he knows us. That's marvelous. Well, join us this coming Sunday at 1030 at the Woodstock Evangelical Covenant Church, either in the house or online. And we're going to share in what God has been doing with us uh, this week. And it'll be good to hear from one another and see one another and be blessed by, by one another. So I can't wait to see you there.